life of the Dunya. The Dunya. We have to learn Halal. Mm -hmm. I know you're in. Halal. Halal. That means good. Why does it got two syllables? See Halal. Halal. H A L A L. There's Halal and Haram. Halal. 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 And har Haram. Haram. Okay, we have Halal and Halal is good. Halal. Haram is evil. Yeah, Haram is like drinking a glass of wine. Or taking stealing money and so an orphan can't have his tummy full that's haram stealing money from orphans is very haram but helping orphans is very halal you see how help did you say you want an orphan brother mm -hmm. see that was you intending now you just say one orphan brother, inshallah. You know, if God wills, we'll have an orphan brother waiting for you. <laughs> All right. What happened to your cooking show? Here I need my chaps. Okay. Verse. No. Surah 2, verse 100. This is one of those signs. Each one of these verses is one of those signs that evil people reject here. Let's see if, we, let's see if we're evil, if we reject this or not. I hope we're not. Okay, it is not the case that every time they make a promise, some party among them throws it aside, but most of them are faithless. I didn't, I didn't understand that too well. I guess we didn't reject that. We just didn't understand it too well. Oh, well, okay. When they make a promise, some part, some, wait. Oh, there's probably more to that story that I don't know right now. And when there comes to them a messenger from Allah confirming what was with them, a party of the people of the book threw away the book of the law behind their backs as if they did not know. Okay, I, I understand that one. So when it, when a messenger of the law came to them, remember when Jesus came? Yeah. And they already had the law, they already had, the Jews already had their book. And Jesus told them the law and they threw the book behind their back. They're like, that's not true. Like they forgot everything that they were preaching and then they pretended that they didn't know what they had learned from Allah from his earlier messenger Moses, David, and Solomon, and uh, Jeremiah, and Ezekiel. And there, was a, there was a lot of messengers between Moses and Jesus. You remember David? David and Goliath? David, David was the messenger of the law, and they they didn't really reject him. They rejected Jesus. That, that goes good with Jesus. Okay, where are we? 101. No, 102. Oh, here we go. They followed what the Satans falsified. Okay, this is the Satans, so there's more than one devil here. They followed what the devils falsified against the belief of Suleiman, but the Satans disbelieved, teaching men magic. Oh, Solomon was a prophet, but the Satans taught, said that he was a magician. Wow. And the devils... It's calling them Satans in this verse. Such things as came down to Babel to the angels Herod and Merit. These are two idolized men from the ancient times. Oh, really? Uh, hey, 
they're making crumbs in this room and we haven't even don't okay we learned from the Satan's the means to cause separation between a man and his wife I bet they did that with credit cards but they could not harm anyone except by a law's permission see so these even if they were angels they came down and they tempted people to learn magic and but don't make crumbs on yourself don't eat nicer than that if they kept the faith and guarded themselves from evil and their duty to Allah far better than had been the reward from their Lord if they only knew O oh, you who believe, do not say ambiguous words like Reina. It says it's an insult in Hebrew to the prophet. But say clearly words of respect like Unzerna. Make us understand. Oh, so we need to, when you find like the people of knowledge, just ask them to make you understand. And, and then listen carefully. For those without faith, there is a painful punishment. Remember the day of resurrection? Mm -hmm. You wake up and uh, God's there and you know everything. <laughs> you saw everything. You get handed a record of everything you did in your life. Remember? You got to stand there for 50,000 years in front of the sun thinking about everything you did. That's where they give you if you are haram or halal. That's where you want your halal to, to outweigh the haram. So if you did more good deeds than e a lot more good deeds than evil, they'll hand you your um, paper, and you'll stand there for fifty thousand years, watching everyone else get thrown into the fire, and you'll be happy because you won't be getting thrown into the fire. That makes you happy, doesn't it? To like find out that you're one of the ones that don't have to go th be thrown in the fire forever. I know it's getting scary. Cuddle up to bear, it's gonna get scary. It is never the wish of those without faith among the people of the book or the wish of the pagans that anything good should come down to you from your Lord, but Allah will choose for his special mercy, whoever he will choose, and Allah is the Lord of extreme grace. So that's the, the people that don't have any faith in God. They don't want any, they don't want God to be able to prove to you that you're blessed by, they don't want anything good to come down to you from God. So, but there's nothing they can do about it anyway. None of our revelations do we change or cause to be forgotten, but we substitute something better or similar. Do you not know that Allah is power over all things? Do you also not know that to Allah belongs the kingdom of the heavens and the earth? And except him, you have neither a friend nor a helper. So on the day of resurrection, everyone's just going to have to stand in their place that the angel brought him to. Well, when you get woken up from your grave, they bring you to the day of resurrection. So, if you you'll be happy about it if you're well, the angel will be carrying you there. I think take, perhaps, I don't know from years. the graveyard to the day Does of resurrection. It take two hundred years to get there. No, fifty thousand years. It's a long day. Fifty thousand years is a very long day. Oh, that's longer than our life here. Our life here is like maybe a hundred years if we're lucky. Fifty thousand years is wait, if you took fifty times a hundred, wait. No, that's if you took five hundred. Five hundred. Oh, 
that's like a hundred lifetimes, except you're just standing there being judged. I think when you're being judged for 50,000 years, you want to have a few good deeds under your belt to bring with you to the day of resurrection. You, you don't want to come there with evil deeds. If you did evil, you're not going to want to stand there for 50,000 years and be punished for the evil you did. That's not going to be fun. So, I hope this isn't getting too scary for you. Or would you question your prophet Muhammad as Mo Moses, who was questioned in the old days? And whoever changes from faith to disbelief indeed has strayed without doubt from the right way. So, when you go to the day of resurrection, what's the deeds called that are good? Do you remember? Two syllables? Remember two syllables? Da, da. Virgin. No, halal. <gasps> no, halal. <laughs> when you get to the day of resurrection, you want to have a book of halal deeds that you did. And the deeds aren't always the action. Remember, if, if a rock falls on the bathroom and you were intending to brush your teeth and you didn't get to brush them? You, the angels still write down that you are going to brush your teeth. The angels write down what you are gonna, what you told yourself in your heart. In your in your froggy heart. Hmm. You're not learning the lesson. 